Moving on. Moving on. People are joining late. So in last class, what we were discussing, beta? So in the last class, we were discussing the question paper, by now, if I'm not wrong. Yes. So in today's class, we'll uh, go with the pair of linear equations in two variables. Shall we go with that? Yes, sir. Okay. One second. I think uh, pair of linear equations we done couple of questions. Okay, angle between two lines be done. Perpendicularity condition, condition for parallel, yes. I think I'm not sharing the screen, I'm sorry. Yes. So guys, we done till uh, perpendicularity and uh, parallelism condition. So what is the perpendicularity condition? The perpendicularity condition was, when two lines are perpendicular to each other, so the product of the slope should be equal to minus one. So look at this. So when two lines are perpendicular, the product of their slopes is going to be minus one. So when two lines are parallel to their slopes are equal. <coughs> okay. So now look at this. State the equation of the line which has y intercept minus one and parallel to this. And we have done this equation. I mean, this, we have done this question as well. Okay. So now what we do? In today's classes, we will solve the word problems. So solving word problems, how can we make that actually? Okay. So many problems can be solved quickly by uh, quickly and uh, easily by converting them into a system of pair system of a pair of linear equations of the two variables as follows. Okay. So now so this represent unknown quantities by variable x and y which are to be determined okay represent unknown quantities by variable x and y which are to be determined find the conditions given in the problem and translate the verbal conditions into a pair of simultaneous linear equations solve these equations and obtain the required quantities with appropriate units so basically So this is what uh, the basic idea we have to uh, like you know, we have to gain when you solve word problems. 
all right yes so first of all let us try to understand the question given here the numerator of a fraction is 4 less than the denominator if the numerator is decreased by 2 and the denominator is increased by 1 then the denominator is 8 times the numerator find the fraction so try to read the question again what he has given here try to so try to solve everyone look at the question the numerator of a fraction 4 less than the denominator okay first of all required fraction we do not look at this here find the fraction he has given so as per the guidelines as per the date look at his data what do we have to do we have to represent unknown quantities by variable x and y to be determined so i'm representing the unknown quantities by x and y and the required fraction i'm taking it as x by y beta okay this is our you know required fraction now if i take this as my required fraction look at this here x by y right so what he has given here, the numerator of a fraction is 4 less than the denominator. So, the numerator of a fraction is 4 less than, is nothing but y is equal to x plus 4. Correct? The numerator of a fraction is 4 less than, is nothing but x is equal to y minus 4. Correct? Isn't it? x is equal to y minus 4 or not beta numerator is x which is 4 less than the denominator which is nothing but y minus 4 am i correct am i correct x is equal to y minus yes, 4 sir. yes and if the numerator is decreased by 2 and the denominator is increased by 1 so uh, increased by 1 numerator is decreased by 2 right so uh, now let us write numerator decreased by 2 so x minus 2 okay which is equal to and the numerator is increased by 1 so y plus 1 minus 4 okay then the denominator 8 times of the numerator uh, the denominator is or else we'll do one thing as per this we will make a, an equation here uh, very simple let us write everything in x minus y is equal to or else uh, minus 4 right so what we do here is y minus x is equal to 4 correct this is what he has given from that i wrote this so now what he has given uh, the denominator is increased by 1 which is nothing but y plus 1 y plus 1 minus x in fact we can write this y here as per he has given we can write y what is y here y is equal to x plus 4 okay numerator denominator is increased by 1 which is equal to and uh, the denominator is what x plus 4 decreased by 2 right okay so then it is will be 8 times y plus 1 is equal to 8 times of x minus 2 x 4 minus 2 is 2 right so 8 minus 8 of x minus 2 so what we are going to get now so solve this y min is equal to 8x minus 16 minus 1 minus 17 so this is one equation let us take this is one equation given this is second solving these two solving 1 and 2 from 1 and 2 what you are going to get beta so or else we will take this as we will take this as first equation which one this one solving 1 and 2 so y and y right so y minus 1 minus 2, I'm subtracting 1 minus 2. 1 minus 2 is nothing more. Y, y will be getting cancelled. So minus 7x or else we will do one thing. We will do 2 minus 1. Okay, 2 minus 1 is nothing but 7x minus 21 is equal to 0. X is equal to 3. Am I correct? All yes, right, sir. x is equal to 3. If x is equal to 3, what is y value beta? 7. From this, from the first equation. From the first equation. Okay. So, now what is the required fraction now? 7 by, so 3 by 7 is my required fraction. Three by y, so 3 by 7 is my required fraction. All right, any doubts? Any doubt, guys? Very simple. Word problems are like you know very simple actually, but you, know, you need little presence. That's it. Next question. 
solution of a system of any doubts in the previous question guys no sir very simple now solution of a system of a pair of equations reducible to the system of a pair of linear equations in two variables okay solution of a system of pair of equations reducible to the system of a pair of linear equations in two variables okay by using the suitable substitutions by using the suitable substitution look at this suitable substitution or simplification first we convert the given system into system of a pair of linear equations into variables then the then after using any algebraic or graphical method we solve the system so this is what he has given okay now we'll do one thing so solve for x and y solve for x and y solve for x and y now how can we solve this guys look at this is one equation given this is another equation given to you so basically first of all let me modify the equation how can i modify this equation 3y plus 4x is equal to xy okay and how can i modify this equation 4 2x plus 4y into 12 is equal to 11xy. I just cross multiplied this into this, this into this. After doing that, this 12 I'm multiplying again. Directly hope you understood how I wrote that step. Now to uh, 24x, 24x plus 48y. Okay, minus or 11xy. You write it. Okay, this is second. this is the first one okay so now what i have to do the first equation and second equation we got perfect now how can i uh, do here here we have 24x here we have 4x so the first equation i need to multiply with 6 clear if i multiply with 6 on both side what i am going to get beta tell me 18y first of all let me write the x variable 24x plus 18y Is equal to six x y. All right. Second equation is twenty four x plus forty eight y is equal to eleven x y. Okay. Subtraction. This two will be getting cancelled. So minus thirty y is equal to minus five x y. Y y will be getting cancelled. One x one x. I'm oh, sorry. Minus minus will get cancelled. So five x is equal to thirty. X is equal to six. Are there any doubts? Any doubts? No, sir. Very simple, guys. This is how we can solve this. X is equal to six. Then what is y value? Substitute any one of the equation, you will get y value. So let us substitute here. X is equal to so three by six plus four by y is equal to one. So one by two minus one, or else one by two. Plus four by y is equal to one. So four by y is equal to one minus half, which is half. So eight is equal to y. Y is equal to eight. All right. Y value is eight. So look at this here. Y value is eight. X value is six. That is what we got. Any doubts? Any doubt, guys? Can we scroll up once? No. Tell me any okay, doubts. Sir. Very simple. No doubt. This is how we can. No doubt, sir. Now look at this here. Uh, solid examples we have here. What we do is, okay. Uh, so everyone should solve this equation now. Everyone solve this example too. Quick. Everyone solve the example too. I need a response from everyone. That too privately, not publicly. Quick.
Let's keep solving, make it fast. You have done, put it in the message box. Uh, sir, K uh, I, I meant K equal to sir, not K plus.
Did you get my answer? Right, got it the answer. Got it? Yes, sir. K value is 3. Yes, K value is 5 by 3, not 3. So 5 by 13. Krishna, you gave K value 3. That is 5 by 13. Uh, who's this? Harshil, very good, Harshil. Congratulations, you have done a very good job. Harshil, very good. Thank you. Bhumika, 5 by 13 beta, not 13 by 5. Yukta, very good, Yukta. Dipsika, very good. Hania, no beta. Saranya, very good. Okay, I am not getting answer from everyone. Okay, 5 by 13 is the right answer. Very, very simple. If you know the condition, that's it. What is the condition? No solution condition. What exactly? A1 by A2 is equal to B1 by B2. A1 by A2 is equal to B1 by B2 is not equal to C1 by C2. So we need k value. You just equate any two of the terms. So it's either this two or this two. You will be uh, you will be uh, like getting the answer very quickly. Very simple. So if I equate these two, I got like five is equal to thirteen k. K is equal to five by thirteen. Okay, this is how it will be. Better. Any doubts? No, sir. So now next question, everyone solve th example third. It has infinitely many solution. Only only 40 seconds. 40 seconds of the time. Make it fast. Quick.
Sir, I messaged you my answer. Very good, Saranya. Very good, Kavya. Very good, Yukta. Did you got my answer? Ujwal, no, Ujwal. So this is Aditi. Adi, no, 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 Aditi. No, no, I, I know Aditi. You are Aditi only, but no, I didn't get it. So I sent you once. Just going to check. You sent? I didn't get. Harshit. Uh, Harshil, very good, Harshil. So even I sent it. Who's that? Like you might have sent everyone. I mean, you might have sent some other. Uh, you sent me. Arshil, very good. Very well, I have sent you. Very good, Deepsika. I got only few answers. Aditi, I didn't get. Sir, is my answer right, sir? Ujwal, no, Ujwal. Kavya, you are right. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Bhumika, very good. Right. Quick, 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 quick. See, I'm not getting the answers. Why? So I sent you again now. Did you get? So can you hear me? Yes, yes. Tell me, beta. So I sent you again to answer. So I even I sent the answer again. <laughs> What's happening? I didn't get the answer. So it is actually uh, raining here. Maybe net is showing. So it's showing me that uh, the answer have reached. Uh, is re the message is reached to you. Okay, answer many of you, many have you sent the answer, but you know, many of you guys are like, you know, your answer is, answers are not reaching to me. K value is to here. K value is to. Okay, very good. Infinitely many solution is nothing, but this is the condition. A1 by A2 is equal to B1 by B2 is equal to C1 by C2. Okay, so now if you have if you have whenever whenever you have infinitely many solution this is how like you need to solve actually okay this is how we need to solve okay people okay sir next 
now look at this here everyone solve this equation just guys for you know practice purpose only we are making many questions see we these many days we have done concepts now questions 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 making questions the more you solve the more you get okay the more you practice the more you get in the uh, exam so that is what like you know making you guys to solve solve you from my from your from my side job done better from your side you must make the questions and like you know answer my questions make it fast no sir one minute one minute no ujjwal no krishna check check sir that was a previous solution oh ho 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 cool cool Sir, can you hear me? Yes. Sir, I got X S one and Y S. Oh, don't don't reply the answer. Don't tell me the answer openly, please. Okay. Who is that fellow? What is your name? Bhumika, very good. Krishna, no Krishna. Y value is wrong. Sir, I have a small doubt. Yeah. 
answer will the solution be in a fraction form or a normal constant solution i didn't get you the will the solution will the value of x and y will be in a fractional form no but in fact even 2 can also written be in the form of fraction right yes sir yeah not fraction normal number you get Okay, Dipshika, we will solve it. Look at this. First of all, you solve it into normal one. okay so cross multiplication look at this let me write here 5 into 2 10x plus 5 this into this this into this 9y plus 3 divided by 15 is equal to 2 is equal to 30 Is equal twenty two. This into this how much? Four x to twenty x plus two means ten minus nine y, not nine y twenty seven y. This into this directly I am writing better twenty seven y minus eighteen by fifteen is equal to minus one. So twenty x. Minus twenty-seven y. Sir, in the first one, it is going to be nine y plus six. No, sir. Sorry, sorry, sir. Six y. Plus eleven. Equal nineteen, correct? First equation, second equation. Did you understand what I wrote here? Minus seven. Any doubts? Hmm. Now, let me take take it as first equation. This is second. 
the first equation I'm multiplying with the two. So 20x, 18y, 38. And second equation I'm subtracting. Any doubt, guys? These two will be getting cancelled. So how much? Uh, why did you multiply by two? Why? Because to make it as 20x. If I multiply with the two, so it becomes 20x. Here also have 20x so that I can subtract and I can get rid of x and I can remove x easily for getting y value. Getting my point? So, yes. 45y and 45. So, a y values I got y. Happily. Right? Substitute y value in one of the equation, you will, you will be getting x value. 9 into 1 is equal to 19. Then x value also 1. Tipsika ji, you got it, ji? Sir, can you scroll yes, a little? Sir. Very simply, we solved. I didn't make anything complicated here. Ah. Yes. Sir. Shall I go for the next question? That would be against the lab. I wrote directly this step. Question to sir. Any doubt, guys? <clears throat> no, sir. Very, very no. simple. Yes. Next question. Ah, so all these two equations tell me the answer many of you i'm not getting the answer from everyone guys i request everyone of you to solve it i know that you will not solve it home and send me back i'm making you to solve now that is what you guys have to do make it fast keep now guys only look at this at two minutes of the time okay total three minutes i'll give you for both questions three minutes for both questions you, cho you choose which question you are going to invest more and which question you are going to invest uh, less time. Make it fast. Sir, so once can check mine. Sorry? Sir, so once can you check mine? Okay, guys, you send me both answers. I'll check it out. Let it act. Okay, so first one I sent. First one. No. Send me both answers at a time. Don't send individually. Both answers at a time.
So now I send you again. Mohit, no. Krishna, no. I think Krishna, you are correct. I didn't understand what you said, what you uh, sent here. 1 comma 1 minus 2, what is that, man? Sir, I sent you, sir, first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sir, I, X comma Y, like that. Got it, got it. You are right, you are right. Don't, don't, don't. Please, please, don't delete. I got it. So, I have a single light, man. One second, one second. Kavya, very good, Kavya. First one is right. And uh, Hania, I think you are, you made us a mistake. Mohit, you are right. Bhumika, you are right. Okay. Sir. I asked you to send both answers at a time. Don't send me individually, please. The second one is quite difficult, sir. Sorry? The second one is quite difficult. I didn't get you. The second one is uh, quite difficult, sir. Quite difficult. It is very simple. You can ask me very good, Yukta. Try, try, try. Last minute. Sarah showing off of the answer. Sorry? Sarah showing off of the answer. It's fine, it's fine. First one, everyone done, no problem. Uh, very good, uh, Harshil. Congratulations, Harshil. Mohit, very good. And a very simple, Rabab. Look at this, everyone. Look at this second one. Let me write here directly. I'm, I'm just solving this equation here. Okay, second one. So directly cross multiplication 3x minus y plus 3x plus y divided by this into this, this into this, this into this divided by this into this. So 9x square plus. Minus 3xy plus 3xy minus y square is equal to 3 by 4. Okay. I'm solving the first one. So this, this will be getting cancelled. So cross multiplication again, what do you get? 6x, right? This plus this 6x. So 4, 6, 12x. This, this will be getting cancelled. Is equal to now 47x square minus 3y square. Okay. So let us take this as first equation. Now, now solving this one. Okay, cross multiplication this into this, this into this. So 6x minus 2y minus 6x minus 2y divided by 6x, 6x, one 6x plus 3y and 6x minus 2y. So 2y. So here six x square, so thirty six x square minus four y square, in the denominator part, right? And is equal to minus one by eight. I'm solving this is equal to minus one by eight. Now six x this will get cancelled, so minus thirty two y is equal to minus thirty six x square plus four y square. Okay. Taking what four common. So, taking 4 common, so minus 4 common. Let us take minus 4 common and 4 common. Anything is fine. So, here, minus 4 common, so 8y. Here, minus 4 common, so 9x square minus y square. Nine x square 
plus. So minus four minus four will be getting cancelled. So nine x square minus y square minus eight y is equal to zero. Okay. So here twenty seven x square minus three y square minus twelve x is equal to zero. Perfect. Yes. Now let us take this as the first equation, and let us take this as the second equation. Okay. Yes. Let me use different color now. Solving one and two, beta. So how can you solve the first equation? I'm multiplying with three. Okay. So three x square. So three means nine seven. How much? Multiplying three on both sides. Twenty seven. So nine seven twenty seven x square minus three y square minus twenty four y is equal to zero. Subtracting this plus minus. Correct. So now this two will be getting cancelled. This two will be getting cancelled. So minus thirty six. So not minus thirty six, but you will be getting what? You will be getting uh, here plus right. So minus two l x. Plus twenty four y is equal to zero. So if I take minus two by common, so x minus two y is equal to zero, right? So this is yes. what I get now. X is equal to y I got. X is equal to two y I got. Now x is equal to two y in fact. X is equal to two y in fact. Minus two by common, so x minus two. Is equal to zero, right? So x is equal to y. I got now. How can I make here now? So substitute anywhere. Ah, so now look at this here. Let me take this equation. Let me take this as a. Or let, this is my second equation, right? So substituting this x value in the second equation from the second equation. Twenty-seven x square is nothing but into four y square minus three y square minus two x is equal to zero. So two x is nothing but beta here. So we need to x two y right is equal to zero. Okay. So now here fifty one zero eight y square minus three y square minus twenty four y is equal to zero. So how much here one zero five right? One zero five. Oh, patiently, if you solve it, definitely will get it. Is equal to twenty four y. Oh. Minus. Anywhere we made a mistake. Check. X is equal to two y. I got. Yes, guys, look at this here. X is equal to y. I got right. So this x value substituted in one of the equations, beta. I think somewhere we made a calculation mistake. I think we have done time. We forgot. So I have another class. Let us leave now. I have to rush, beta. So x value two y. I got right. This x value take and substitute either in one equation or two equation. Any one of the equation, you will be getting y value and x okay. values and find it out, beta. Please find it out. Whatever we have done, I think uh, if I am not. If I'm not wrong, everything like you know we made correct only. But check if any mistakes, you check it out. I'll be sharing this note as it is. Okay, okay. so let's make a move now. Thank you. I have another class for you, seniors. Thank you. Thank you, Beta. So please do continue from this. If you don't get, I'll teach you the next class. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.